Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. Before we do begin today's video, make sure you guys are all smashing that subscribe button. Make sure you're dropping a nearly like as well. But anyway guys, in today's video, I'm going to be covering another variant in today's episode. The one I did say at the end of last episode, which is going to be the MP7 Purple Tracer. I do believe it's still in the store, so make sure you do go and grab it for yourself. It's super insane. It also comes with the Purple Tracer Growl as well. If you missed that video, make sure you do go and check it out. It's the most recent video or click it at the pop-up at the end of the video. Also, so guys it's double xp double tiers double weapon tiers so make sure you guys are grinding this weekend make sure you hit max rank if you haven't already before season five season four even sorry starts in literally a couple of days i already have a load of cod points loaded up onto the account uh, so i'm all ready for season four i seriously can't wait there's a lot of new things a lot of awesome things coming in in that season so make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button again so you don't miss out on any season four content when it does arrive but anyway guys as you can see on the screen this is the mp7 variant this is how it comes stock uh, as it is. I have made my own class setup like I did for the Growl, which I'll show you in just a second. It's pretty decent. This is a better setup than the Growl. It comes standard. Very, very awesome looking gun. In my opinion, this one looks a lot better than the Growl. I don't know why I think that, but it just does. But like I said in the last video, it is pretty boring. You know, there's not much going off. There's a lot cooler variants. I wish it was a little bit cooler, but it is what it is. The purple bullets on its own are insanely cool anyway. But as you can see on your screen right now, this is the class setup I will be rocking in today's video. This is my favourite go-to MP7 class setup. Probably one of the best setups you can make in my opinion. So make sure you do try to set up out for yourself. And this variant is also a little bit better than the standard MP7. Just because the iron sights are a little bit more clearer in my opinion. So awesome in that aspect. But without further ado guys, I don't want to waste any more of your time. I'm going to hop straight into a gameplay right now. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. And I'll see you guys in the gameplay. Okay guys, we're playing Shipman. I felt felt like it was only fitting to do a gameplay on Shipman as we do have the 24-7 playlist. So make sure you guys are grinding that as well. Super awesome for getting camos and stuff like that. And that's going to die straight off the rip, which is super annoying. Always happens to me on ship, uh, Shipman. Oh my god, there's a kid with a shotgun in this lobby. If this guy with a shotgun is just like this all game, oh my days, I'm having an awful start. Hopefully we can pick it. Oh my god, this kid with a shotgun. Seriously, the kid with the shotgun is probably the most annoying thing in these lobbies. I seriously hate shotgun players and shoot uh, shipment. I keep calling it shoot house, but yeah, they're so annoying. If you have a, sh especially if they've got a right shield on the back as well. I don't know why, but it just makes them ten times more annoying. We definitely aren't having the best start to this game as we get a nice little triple kill there. Let's go. Hopefully, we can get a little streak going. I'm playing a little hard point as well. Oh my god, what even is this? I don't get killed by a car or Mark II carbine, I don't even know. I hit, people tend to use that a lot on this map. Which, to be fair, I guess that's a pretty decent thing to do. I mean, the, the Mark II, oh my god, the Mark II carbine is insane, to be fair. I think that's what I got killed by. And these kids aren't looking or paying attention. I'll pick them up, thank you. Nice little triple kill again. But the iron sights on this variant are super, super good. Oh my god, get absolutely destroyed. I'm pretty sure they're on another MP7 variant. I don't know which one it is. I know I have it unlocked, but I never bothered using it. I don't know why, because I saw these iron sights and I thought they didn't look very good to be fair, but I think they're the exact same on this one, and I'm loving them to be fair, they're a lot more clearer, a lot better than the original ones anyway, in my opinion. You, Oh my god, thank god for that hit marker, that kid didn't even want to reach out. Got that VTOL, he literally hit me once and was dipping out of there. Don't know why he did that, but we've got a VTOL super weak, I wonder if we'll choke the advance today. Will we choke it? We always do, so I'm going to say yes, we didn't choke it in the last video. And I'm kind of being a little scared here because I always get killed by my own VTOL on this map. What is that kid doing? Let's try and push out a bit. We need three more kills for the advance. Hopefully we can get it in. Also, guys, we're trying to... Oh, my God. Get absolutely melted. We're trying to get 1,300 subscribers by the end of the month. It's the 29th today. So it's looking kind of slim. We're around 20 subscribers. Oh, my God. We're around 20 subscribers away. So if you guys could smash that subscribe button, if you do enjoy the video, obviously... Oh, what on earth is this kid? How did he kill me? What on... How did he just kill me? How did he kill me? Oh, my life. I just got absolutely flicked on. Holy crap! But, we'll, you know, we'll, we'll keep going. We'll take it in our stride. But, yeah, oh, for the shotgun guy, man. He's super annoying me. But make sure you guys just smash that subscribe button. You know, try, hopefully we can hit it. I mean, 20 subscribers away in the next three days. It's looking kind of slim, but you know, I kind of like to set crazy goals. And if, oh my god! And if we don't reach the goal, you know, it is what it is. We'll keep going. We'll keep pushing forward. We're always smashing new goals every single day. This growth is still super good right now. I'm loving it. I'm, the support on the channel is amazing, and I can't thank you guys seriously enough. And I don't know how I'm survived there. And how have these got a VTOL? I have no idea. 
and this kid with a shotgun is going to get melted. I'm hiding from the VTOL in this crate, man. I don't want to get absolutely destroyed by the VTOL. But I still stand by what I said in the previous video a while back. The VTOL doesn't seem to be as good as it used to be at the start of this game. Oh my god, I want to throw. I tried to throw that back, but I throw my MC4. Well, she would, oh my god, shotgun guy. I'm glad I'm killing him in this crate. I want to annoy this kid because all he does is annoy me all game. If you use shotgun, then you're just annoying. The most annoying people in this game, in my opinion. So I do apologise, but just not my style. Unless you're going for camos, then I'll, I'll kindly let you, uh, you know, I'll accept that. But if you're using it for fun, it's annoying me, big time. But I mean, it's what it is. These guys going to be, oh my god, I'm going to die. C4, please. No, denied. I don't know how that C4 didn't hit anyone. Oh my god, I've been throwing knifed. Literally, I hardly ever get killed by the throwing knife. I can't remember the last time I. Oh my god, he's still in the crate. Last time I got killed by the throwing knife, I literally have no idea when that was. Literally can't remember. Probably the cross map one back in Modern Warfare 2 or something stupid like that. Nah, but I'm only joking. I don't. I just can't remember when it was last um, been killed by one. I don't even think people even ran. Oh my days! I didn't even think people ran it these days, but it's what it is. There's also a little thing as well, if you didn't know the throwing knife, if you have the throwing knife on and you go, oh my god, and you go to melee someone, it will actually knife them so you get a one hit kill. Fun little fact for you there in Modern Warfare, oh my days. Obviously, so it won't be a two hit melee, just in case you were wondering, you know, you might use that to your advantage, I don't know. Oh my days, I'm getting melted right now. Shoot, Shipman is just, so, oh my god. Shipman is such a crazy map, I swear, like... It can actually go from a good game to a bad game to a good game to a bad game, all in the same game. Bro, what are you talking about, man? Oh my days, this kid with the shotgun, oh, it's just so annoying. Literally, shotguns, man, they're just, you can't even do anything against a shotgun, I don't even care. Like, you could be the best player in the world, and that kid with that shotgun there would have still killed you. It's just stupidity, oh my days. What's that kid bunny hopping for like that? With a shotgun as well. Goodbye, oh my days. Oh my days, oh my life. We've got a hit marker with that. <clears throat> We're one kill off a of VTOL right now. Don't want to choke it again. We are losing this game though, just. Hopefully we can have a pretty decent win. That kid's got beamed. I'll take them both. Three kills off an advance right now. Two kills off the advance. Will we choke it this time? I hope not. That kid's far. Oh, there we go. I love the MP7, man. Honestly, it's so, so good. And now they bring this variant in, and there's a guy just got in front of me. Teammates managed to pick him up. Since I've added this very in, I think I'll use it a lot, lot more. I did a video covering it just the other day as well. I think it's nearly got 200 views, actually, so thank you guys for that. Uh, saying that, is this the best SMG in the game? As we die there, unfortunately, but the MP7, I think it could... Oh, my God, this kid with a shotgun. Thank God he hit-marked me. I'd have been so annoyed. Where this is so hectic right now. We're still losing, though. Oh, my God, they've been shot with the car again. That kid's kind of even more annoying than the shotgun guy. But to be fair, it takes a little more skill, so I'll... Uh, I'll give him that. I think shotguns just, you know, it's just you. Oh my days! Look at this guy with a shotgun. You're just bopping people. You know, you don't even have to really try. It is fun to use a shotgun though now and then, but it's just super annoying. I mean, I'm so glad the snake shots have been nerfed as well. I've not even actually come across any snake shot players in these lobbies, but I know the Ren Akimbo Renetti has got nerfed as well, or the Renetti in general. Um, but I still come across a few people absolutely destroying me with them, and it's getting super annoying. Oh my days! There's 20 seconds left of this game and we are winning this game. I'm going to try and hold this hard point though. To try and lengthen this game a little bit. Get a few more kills under the belt. Hopefully we can do that. 15 seconds left and this kid's going to push with the crate. You're dead my friend. There's 26 seconds on this hard point as well. Oh my god I'm going to die. 54 kills right now so I'm not doing too bad. Let's try and get this hard point back again though. Oh my god there's a frag. Thank god for EOD. He's in this crate to my left. Oh my days, get out of my face. Oh my life. Oh, I'm dead, I'm dead. Wow. This has been a pretty insane game. This MP7 variant is literally so, so fun. We didn't have too bad of a game as well, dropping two VTOLs in advance, 59 kills to end it off. Damn, it was such a fun game, actually, to be fair. This MP7 is a melt machine. Okay, guys, we're back in the lobby. Make sure you do try this MP7 class out apart for yourself. The fact it has purple bullets makes it just that little bit more fun to use. I don't know why. Just because maybe it's a bit more annoying for the enemy when you get killed by it. I know I feel more annoyed when I get killed by someone with cool, colourful bullets. I don't know why it is like that, but that's just the way it is. But yeah, I'm pretty sure this is still in the store, so make sure you do grab it for yourself. I'm pretty sure it won't be much longer. It definitely won't be in Season 4. I know it won't. I'm pretty sure they'll update the whole thing. 
So make sure you grab it while you can. It does come with a pretty awesome growl one as well. So make sure you check out my previous video on that if you haven't already. But like I said earlier, guys, we're trying to smash 1,300 subscribers by the end of the month. Only a couple of days left now, so it's getting really, really close. We're around 20 subscribers away. So make sure you guys are smashing that subscribe button. But anyway, guys, this is going to be the end of the video, unfortunately. Thank you guys ever so much for watching. If you did enjoy the video, hit that subscribe button. I feel like I've said that a million times this video, but just smash that subscribe button. Honestly, you won't regret it. We upload daily Call of Duty content over here on the channel every single day, whether it be news, class setups, anything like that. So make sure you are hitting that subscribe button. Anyway, I'm not going to say subscribe anymore. Make sure you smash a like on this video if you did enjoy it. If you are already subscribed, make sure you do have bell notifications turned on so you don't miss out on a single video I do upload. Also, make sure you follow me on my Instagram and my Twitter. Links for them are in the description to stay up to date with any other thing that's going on in my life. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Peace.